In this uh, video clip we're going to look at distance charts. So here's an example of a distance chart. Uh, quite often you'll see these in um, sort of books like the AA handbook that you might have in your car um, or on websites where you're looking at distances between different locations. Um, before we start this, can I just say that I've downloaded this. I don't know if these distances are real, uh, so if there's a mistake in any of them, um, I apologise now. So, uh, let's have a look at two different questions, okay? The first question says, work out the distance from Bristol to Taunton, okay? So, if you want to do that, what you've got to do is you've got to find where Bristol and Taunton are in the diagram. So here we've got Bristol, and here we've got Taunton. So what we're going to do is we're going to follow the Bristol line and the Taunton line, to find where they meet. They meet here at 51. That means that Bristol and Taunton, according to this diagram, are 51 miles apart. So that's the first question done. The answer would be 51. So the key is to follow in if they want the distance from Bristol to Taunton, you find the Bristol column and the Taunton row and you follow them in to find where they meet. The next question then says, which two cities are the furthest apart? So to find the two cities of the furthest apart, look for the largest number in the diagram. The largest number in the diagram is 194 miles. You can see then that would be what you would get if you followed in the Brist or followed down the Bristol uh, column and followed uh, left from the Penzance row. That means that Bristol and Penzance are the two cities of the furthest apart.